Hello, this is Rabia Parvez. Welcome to Telebiz. Telebiz is a premier private production facility in Pakistan. We specialize in the production of business, news, current affairs and entertainment programming for an extensive network of local, regional and international channels such as PTV Network, PTV World, ARY Asia, ARY Europe, CNBC Asia, CNBC India, Uni Plus, Z International and Z Gold. We pride ourselves in offering state-of-the-art graphics, animations and production facilities to the discerning clientele. At present, we make three daily and 11 weekly programs. Let's take a look at some of our daily programs. Assalamu alaikum. Nazeeha Lehmood, Aaj Ki Tijarati Khadra Ke Saath. Assalamu alaikum or subh khair. Business or stock markets ki latest news or analysis ke saath, OS Afridi. Or Mehmo Naveen Jaan. Shuja, thank you for joining us. Shuja, is hafte market kaafi pressure mein dekhi gai. Agle hafte aapke khayal mein market kis tarah behave karegi aur kis tarah behave karegi. السلام علیکم معیشت سے متعلق کاروباری خبروں کے ساتھ ہوں السلام علیکم یونی بزنس نیوز کے ساتھ مہرین نیازی آر ویکلیز انکلوڈ آر انٹرناشنل پروگرامز ہیر از ای کوئک لوگ ویلکم بائی یونیٹڈ بینک لیمیٹڈ اس ٹو لانچ اس فیسٹ ایور ایکوٹی میچل فنڈ ویبن بود نیکس تری منتس ویبن ڈیٹیلز ان دس رپورٹ After the success of its money market fund UMF, United Bank Limited is now ready to introduce its first ever equity mutual fund. Hello and welcome to Unibiz Week. In this program, we bring you latest business news updates. Our top stories this week are Pakistan and Japan hold a business forum in Karachi. ویلکم بیک دو نئے موبائل کنٹرول آپریٹرز کو لائسنس جاری کرنے کے لیے پاکستان ٹیلی کمیکیشن آتھارٹی اگلے دو وی آلسو میک کارپریٹ ویڈیوز اینڈ ڈاکیمنٹریز Court, a fascinating blend of green pastures, cottage industries, and multinational global outreach. Traditionally an agriculture district, but now a city well known throughout the world for its sports goods. Ever since the football stitching business has been referred to the International Labour Organization for monitoring. Pakistan has completely eliminated child labor from its football industry. The work being done to eliminate child labor from the soccer ball industry in Pakistan. Two years ago, thousands of children under the age of 14 worked for 50 companies stitching soccer balls full time. The industry, the ILO and UNICEF joined together to remove children from the production of soccer balls and give them a chance to go to school and to monitor the results. Today, the work has been taken up by women in 80 poor villages in Pakistan, giving them new employment and their families new stability. Meanwhile, the children have started to go to school. 
so that when they come of age, they will be able to do better jobs raising the standard of living of their families, their villages, and their nation. I thank all who were involved in this endeavor and ask others to follow their lead. The story of textiles in the subcontinent is the story of Gul Ahmad. Gul Ahmad first began trading in textiles in the early 1900s. This is Pakistan. The warm waters of the Arabian Sea lap at its shores, which stretch over 1,000 kilometers of ruggedly beautiful coastline. These pristine tropical waters are a source of livelihood for thousands of fishermen who troll them because these waters are home to a dazzling variety of sea life. The ICI PTA plant, located in the eastern heavy industrial zone of Port Carson, is a world-class facility with an installed capacity of 400,000 tons per annum. Islamic Republic of Pakistan is also on the road to rapid technological advancement. With a solid industrial base and modern infrastructure, it is positioning itself to meet not only its domestic consumption levels, but also the ever-increasing demand abroad for much sought-after quality Pakistani products. environment at Pakistan state oil we believe in this too with special attention and care given to health safety and environment for everyone we the Boeing company and a host of international organizations are paying tribute to individuals and corporates that have contributed to the Middle East economy with the Mead awards for business excellence What we say is that children should be orphaned or abandoned children. Yeah, that's weird. But you say, baby. You know, but you're young and short. You know, but you're short. You're young and quiet. 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 You're young and the warmth of her love is a stark contrast to the cold and harsh reality of the highest battlefield in the world. The Siachen Glacier is the only inhabitable place in the area where for six months the snow saps its life out.
It's hard for Palvasha to forget that she is a refugee. It's reaffirmed every morning. The new Shamshatu refugee camp where Palvasha now lives lies in northwest Pakistan near the Afghan border. Palvasha was 10 when her family fled from their homeland in the year 2000 when Taliban power in Afghanistan was at its peak. She came to Pakistan with her parents, four brothers, one sister, and the memory of another sister, Adila, who was forced to stay behind. We worked at the bakers. At that time, there used to be a coping system to get bread, and there we used to work. Sometimes we used to go there and work at night. That's when they kidnapped my sister. Recently, Telebiz has made a video presentation on the investment potential in Sindh for ITCN International Investors Conference. Present day Pakistan, the land straddling the mighty river Indus, has been home to some of the world's oldest civilizations. Here, for thousands of years, men and women have engaged in arts, crafts and industry. Our corporate philosophy, quality, integrity and professionalism is how we endeavor to serve our clients.